we had had an opportunity at a previous job that I had to uh, witness the uh, connection software. Jim and his uh, team came in and made a presentation to us and it very much intrigued me. And when I came to Arkansas Federal Credit Union, I was a brand new CEO. And the organization had uh, become very siloed, uh, lack of communication. Uh, a lot of things were filtered through one individual, through the CEO. And in fact, uh, lots of people never attended even the board meetings. And so I knew we needed to change the way we're, we were communicating as an organization. Plus, the board had a desire to grow. And our BHAG, Big Harry Audacious Goal, was to double the size of the credit union in assets in five years, which was a large, large undertaking and a, and a huge, huge uh, hill to climb. And I knew that if we were going to do that, if we were going to accomplish what the board wanted to accomplish, we were really going to have to try some things differently. And so the connections piece, the, the ability to get us organized, the ability to change the culture, the ability to integrate what we were doing within the entire organization really made a huge difference. You know, we went from being very siloed, as I said, to now we were dependent on each other. The organization went from very vertical, I flattened it. And connections certainly helped allow that to happen because it built that teamwork and that dependency on each other. You know, there's, I'm sure there's other softwares and processes out there. And I'm sure that if we got a lot of people in a room, they would all be passionate about their software or their process that they're following. But what I think distinguishes the connections process and software is really three things. The first thing is that it builds communication from the bottom up. Getting information from the lowest level in the organization allows me to fully understand what's going on and then help form the direction that the organization is going to head that matches what the board wants accomplished. So that's the first critical piece that I think distinguishes it. Secondly, the software is so stinking simple. So it gives you an actual tool something that you can embrace and use like a shovel or a hoe or anything else that you would use. It's a tool that is very simple, very transparent, uh, works on a Windows-based software program and so it, it's very easy. And, and the third point for me is the fact that I was able to allow the staff to make the decision. You know, I told you I'm different. I'm not your typical CEO, and you, you know, I've said that, and, and if you told, talk to my staff, they'd tell you that too. But the key is, is to let your staff see the value in what they're doing. Staff likes to have communication with the top. Staff likes to know their voices are being heard. And so the connections process, the connection software, allowed them to see, wow, I'm going to be able to give input. I'm going to be able to give feedback and it's going to start at the lowest level from a teller telling her head teller who's telling the branch manager who's telling the regional who's telling the VP and I get to hear it. That particular function is unlike anything else I've ever seen in the marketplace. And for my style that fit perfectly because it allowed my staff the freedom and emphasize the importance of what they were doing in coaching and directing their staff. That it wasn't about what they wanted, it was about what the members wanted and how the employees could fulfill that through this piece of software. You know, if, if you're debating at all whether this is, you know, like worth your time or worth your effort, duh, go look at our call report. Go look at the call report 123105 and look at the call report 123110. Look at what the organization accomplished. Not what I accomplished. The staff did it. I mean, we did something like 85 projects in five years. And I'm not talking about little, you know, easy projects. I'm talking about vendor conversions and, and new products and new services and building branches and 
I mean, it was a cornucopia of projects. And so to look at what we've accomplished and what the staff was able to do, and more importantly, what for me, it was the same staff that was there. It, I didn't bring anybody with me. It's the same group that was there when I got there. And they are doing what they need to do to run their businesses. They're empowered. In fact, I had one of the staff members tell me after a couple years, and, and this is kind of an aside to the connections, which I think is really a good story. He, he said, you know, I'm not sure I could work anywhere that doesn't have it. Really? You really mean that? He, he says, yeah, he said, Larry. He says, I have dialogues with you. My staff is better informed. They feel a part of what's going on. Man, if I wanted to go work somewhere else and they didn't have connections, I'd probably have to stay here. Well, now that's a good thing for me as a leader. It builds loyalty in the employee base, but it really speaks volumes to what this particular process and software can mean to you. So, man, it, you know, call Jim. He'll come out, he'll sit down with you. I mean, he's an easy guy to work with, okay? Yes, he's opinionated. Yes, he is. And, and, and he's passionate about what he believes is good. But the other part of him is that he will make it fit in your organization. He understands, as I said before, one size does not fit all. So yeah, if you're thinking about connections, you gotta make the phone call, you gotta pick up the you know, email, do whatever you gotta do to get a hold of Jim. And, and let me tell you what, don't just talk to me. Talk to the other satisfied clients that he has. I mean, because you know, we're not the only credit union using this. We're not the only organization that does this. And, and it's not just a credit union product. I mean, this, this product could work for any organization, irregardless of size and irregardless of what it's trying to come up with.